Eastern pantheistic monism is James Sire's way of trying to describe the basic underlying worldview of five different world religions that were founded hundreds of years ago in the areas we now call China, Japan, and India. And these five religions are Hinduism, Buddhism, Shintoism, Taoism, and Confucianism. And I don't want you to be confused, so we're going to try to uh, explain what Sire is talking about here. But these religions came about during the time of basically the writing of the Old Testament. From uh, Moses to Malachi, there was about a thousand years there, 1400 to 400 BC. And India, China, and Japan, those are countries that are in the East. And the idea of pantheistic is the idea that everything is God. So theism is the idea of God. Monotheism is what uh, Christianity is about, and that means there's only one God. Polytheism means that there are many gods, but pantheism means that everything is God. When you, when you put everything all together in the entire universe, that becomes an understanding of God. And what the Bible teaches is that God created everything and he's over everything, but he himself is uncreated. There's a separation, a distinction between the creator and his creation. But pantheism doesn't have that distinction. And that's the big difference between naturalism and pantheism. Naturalism believes that all that exists is the universe, but there's no spirituality to it. Pantheism believes that all that exists is the universe, and the universe itself is spiritual. In some ways, they talk about the material as being just an illusion. And the monism part is the idea that everything is one. All distinctions are actually just an illusion. Good and evil are one. God, to the pantheist, is not a person, but more of an energy. Uh, and the New Age is a very contemporary adaptation of Eastern pantheistic monism. New Age takes the spirituality of the old religions and kind of puts a great emphasis on it on the individual. And uh, the individual is elevated to the highest being of their own in order to be God in contact and in control of the entire universe.